Uh, what's good? This is Cam Reddish uh, from the Atlanta Hawks, and you're watching Three Point Conversion. No flow, no, no understanding what was going on in that fourth quarter. Um, spacing, I feel like we got a couple good looks, but I just turned up the pressure in that fourth quarter. We missed shots. They came down and, and, and you know, pushed the ball and got in the paint and made shots. The, the whole team keeping them, they were trying to attack it downhill, get inside. It was a difficulty you saw. We weren't getting quality shots, man. We, we were, it wasn't good shots that we were getting in that first half, even the first two quarters. Can you remind us that more <clears throat> what they did? Was that you guys Us. or was that what they did too? Us. <clears throat> did you see the team playing a role in that at all? Down a little bit. Like maybe, fourth quarter? A little bit, maybe. But we still got, we still can, can be in the right positions to be successful. I feel like it wasn't at all. Everything was uh, just scrambled. It was, our spacing wasn't, um, our spacing execution wasn't great. And uh, they just got out and, and got downhill and, and made some open shots. I, I know this, these foul <coughs> question calls gets a little repetitive. I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> it just seemed like it took you out of your game. No. Nah, at one point, I don't you got to it. It I didn't never got, uh, uh, it didn't take me out of my game. Felt like I played well <laughs> into the fourth quarter. Fourth quarter, we, we none of us played well, so um, it definitely didn't take me out of my game. No, no, it's us, all of us. Fair to say that uh, creating more opportunities in the paint, however you create, whatever that is, whether it's post ups with with Marcus or whether it's driving, is, was that a top priority after you know after this game going forward? When you look back at this game, is that something that cost you guys a lack of? Production of the paint. What is that? Stretch. What was that? I'm asking do you the Marcus post ups? Yeah, I'm saying do you no. think getting more points in the paint, however you get them, is a priority? Yeah, 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 for sure. We definitely want to get in the paint. And that's what, you know, creates layups, it creates um, opportunities for defenses to collapse and, and our shooters get open shots. And we didn't have enough of that, uh, especially in the fourth quarter. Going forward, when you just look at this as kind of a a one-off, a yeah. back-to-back. Bad, bad quarter. Not even a game, just a bad quarter. We only scored 17 points, they scored 42. So that's the game right there. Yeah. Thanks. First off, you were knocking down shots after, but how's your show rest? That's good. Oh, I'm good. I'm good. What was the difference in that fourth quarter? They made they made shots. I mean, they were just aggressive in everything they did, and they got stops and ran out, and you know they got some, they got some high level shot makers on that team, you know, so they made tough ones all night. And, um, you gotta give them credit. They just played with a lot of intensity in that fourth. Locker room after a loss like that, how quickly do you regroup? What do you say to regroup and move your mind forward? Yeah, we're frustrated. I mean, we want to win every game, and uh, it's a good feeling of being frustrated, but understanding that, you know, how we can get better from this and move on from this, and realize we got three more games on this trip, so we can't be. I know we want to, you know, um, you know, get better after each game and reflect on each game, but we got to start moving forward and. We understand why we lost. That's the good part. We got veterans in that locker room that understand as soon as we get off that floor why we took an L. So, um, you know, we just take that into the next game and try to get a win. The paint numbers, is that a reflection partly of the back-to-back -back or something else? No, I just think, I mean, they were aggressive going down here. I felt like they used a lot of pick and rolls and we were planning to drop a little bit and they made those shots. And then, you know, getting out and getting offensive rebounds too helped them. And, you know, when you got your, they got uh, 15 offensive rebounds and they got three from Io and uh, uh, Javante Green got a couple, you know, I, I, they just, you know, it was a team effort for them on the boards. And I think that was the reason why they got shot. So 
I look at just the difference in shots, you know, we have 12 more than us, and that's really the game. Considering, I mean, you guys got, you know, the offensive boards were damaging, but you still guard it. I mean, is it fair to say that your offense is what the problem was in the fourth quarter? Yeah. And was that fatigue or was that them taking you out of what you wanted to do? I mean, they, they did it. They, I mean, I mean, you can probably, I mean, fatigue, I don't know. I mean, I can't talk to my teammates and how they felt, but you know, I don't want to just throw that excuse out there. Um, I feel like they got it. They did a good job of getting it to us on our sets, and we also missed some good looks, rush some shots. You know, um, trying to get back into the game. Once we got down five or seven, I think we tried to rush and get back. And once we got down to 11, 12, I feel like we was trying to get it back so fast, and then that just pushed the lead up. They hit a couple threes, got some transition baskets, but it didn't look as bad as the end the end score. You know, um, we were pretty much up going into the fourth. They hit some shots, and uh, we couldn't recover. With you having Demar, Zach, Vooch, you know, different ways to hit you. Yeah, they got tough shot makers. And I think we, uh, I mean, the majority of the night, they were under 45% shooting um, until late in that fourth. But we did a good job of contesting those shots and just living with them. We can't get discouraged when you got all world players like that that can make shots over players, over opponents. Um, so we stayed with it. You know, we, you seen we had some spurts where we got stops, a lot of stops in a row and was able to get a lead. But, you know, some good offense be good defense. driving the way you needed to drive to win this. I mean, in terms of getting penetration, getting in the paint, and if that's the case, yeah. there, did part of that come from, you know, you guys driving early and just not getting calls? Uh, I wouldn't say that. I mean, you know, um, we could have drove more. I mean, we, I mean, we could have made more threes. Like, you know, we could have did everything better. You know what I'm saying? But um, I like where we were for three quarters of this game. Um, we just couldn't finish it out, but we could have did pretty much everything better.